Hi guys! So this video is of what I have done with my Ugly Dory. If you didn't see the unboxing video of this, I did put it on my main channel because I do think people who suffer, not suffer, but people who have problems remembering things, I do think they should have a planner and uh, that's why I wanted to put it on my other channel because I want everybody to know about this because it's amazing. This is a traveller's notebook and I got this from a company called Ugly Dory. She has got a YouTube channel, her and her husband hand make these traveller's notebooks guys. And uh, yeah, I've been a busy bee uh, sorting out what I'm going to put in here and guys, I have finally found planner piece. <laughs> yes, I have. I'll start off by showing you these on this side. This here is a necklace and we went to Home Bargains, I think it was, and this necklace was a pound. It's got a heart on it, it's got that, which I absolutely love. It's got little bits of dangly things, it's got a heart and one of them things. Uh, so that's the first one. The second one, this was also a necklace which I deconstructed and I went to Hobbycraft the other day and I bought a load of beads which I obviously want to make my own dangly things. Uh, they just held on by one of them clasp things on there but yeah I love the jingle jingle of that. One thing that is different, I had like a name tag that was put on here with my name on it. Um, I was struggling a little bit with that so I just took that off because you had to get it perfect every time for it to look nice. Um, because you either take the, the elastic off top or bottom but if you've got stuff at the top I hope, you know, it makes sense to take it off at the bottom. And you just had to get it right every time which to be honest um, was doing me head in a little bit so yeah. Okay, so I have watched so many of these videos, cannot believe I'm doing one myself. Uh, just in these uh, pockets here, this is just a card which I printed off Pinterest. Got it out, put it on some card and all I did with this, because I haven't got anything to laminate it with, I just got some packing tape and just put it around there and that does the job. You know, it's not perfect but it does what you wanted to and that says get stuff done which I think is perfect. Uh, this little thing here was from Hobbycraft as well. Um, I, I had to put that on with acrylic because you're supposed to put this on clothes like iron it on it sticks uh, so obviously I just wanted to end for my name. So yeah just put that there. One thing I really wanted to do is put some washi on this is um, acetate. Acetate's really expensive in the UK. I, did, I only got one sheet and it was nearly three quid for a sheet, couldn't believe it. Uh, but yeah, just in case I'm out and about and I want to do my planning, then I've got some of my favourite washi on there, so I'll just put that in there. Don't think I've got anything in this pocket. No. So this bow here, this I bought from Hobbycraft as well, and this was on offer for a pound. So it was like that. There was I, I I glued this onto it, but yeah, it was like that. And then I've got a load of these things. This is an earring. So I just got some acrylic and I put that just on the bow, and I thought it looked really pretty. So this is some um, acetate, and then these books I got from. Uh, pound stretcher, they were 75 pence. So for that book there, it was 75 pence. The cover was pink. I just put one of these on. These are from Hobbycraft and they are one pound 25 each and they are gorgeous. So I'll be definitely getting some more of them as well as getting some more books. I'm showing you this before I set everything up then don't have to keep hiding stuff. All I've done with these was I got some acrylic paint really washed it down and then just painted my pages because that's what I want my diary to look like. These in the corners, then there, were done by this hole punch and that's what it looks like. I thought I was getting uh, something to round the edges off um, but 
I didn't realise that it's got this pattern in it as well. Uh, yeah, it's quite heavy this is, but this was on offer. I think it was £2 for this big thing. So yeah, I did that with all the pages. So this page here will be my diary. And then this is the other side of the acetate. The next one, again, a book from the range, is my planner. Now, I tried to download any print, any printables for January, February and March. I can't seem to do it. So I've given up. So all I'm going to do is do a uh, two days two days on one page. So I'm going to have this side as my notes. That that's going to be Monday, Tuesday. No, no, I need to stuck together. Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday, Sunday, and then start again. And that's how I'm going to do my um, planner planning stuff because I it was no I just haven't got the patience for it. So this is the same, not the same sheet, but um, I got two sheets out of one big sheet of the acetate. Um, this is something I'm, these pocket things here had like a lid on them, which folded over, but I just cut that out. Um, this is just some cardstock and I put some uh, washi tape on it and I stuck them down. These are printables Monday to Sunday for the dates, which I just stick in there. And in here is because I am on a diet and I'm keeping track of my weight. These were uh, printables as well of scales. So I keep them in there just because I'm obviously tracking my weight every week. So yeah, these are just some fun pockets what I made. The This really pretty bow my mum made and then I just stuck it on, on this paper clip. But yeah, she put all the dangly bits on and everything. She really enjoys doing them. She's thinking about maybe selling them as well. But we'll have to see. So this is the other side of that acetate. Let me bring you in a little bit. Uh, this I have literally just made today. And on here, it says, enjoy the little things in life. For one day, you will look back and realize they were the big things. I just thought that was a really nice quote. And I just got like an envelope type thing and I've stuck it down onto the back of this. This is, These are just some post-it notes. Keep some of these in here just in case I need them. And then this is another card that um, I, it was like a free down, free printable off Pinterest and it says you've got this, you know, inspirational things and you just put, so I love this washi, it's gorgeous. So that is that, that I've made this as well. This is my absolutely gorgeous grandson. Um, so I put this in like another folder thing and the love there is from these things and these are from Hobbycraft. These are about three quid, but yeah, you can use them for all different kind of things. That's just the back of the photo. So this is some vellum that I got from, I don't know, Hobbycraft, the range somewhere. Uh, the, the vellum is a little bit cheaper than the acetate. Uh, this book here is going to be for YouTube. This is another 75 pence book. Um, yeah, I've hid the things here. This is just like when companies get in touch with me and I'm just going to write down when they did, what they want, what they want me to do, what I can pick, blah, blah, blah. So that's it's going to be for that. This one I've just put in and this will be for what they call brain dumping. So any thoughts that I've got on different things like nail designs and whatever, which I'm absolutely desperate and just look how much they've grown out. I am going to change my nails, so ignore them. <laughs> and then the other side of that vellum. Uh, this one is for my meals. Now, if you're on a diet, it's really good to write down your breakfast, dinner and tea. Other people say breakfast, lunch and dinner, but, you know, I'm common. Um, so, yeah, I'm writing it in there. So I've just got Monday to Sunday and I write down everything there where I've had to eat. I don't eat that much to be quite honest with you. 
a hiding of this. Um, so yeah, this book is for that and it's uh, really quite helpful. And there's another another bow what my mum made. It's just extra decorative stuff that, that I, you know, you just, everybody loves putting in the traveller's notebooks. Um, this envelope here is from What's Up Nails and as soon as I saw this envelope I thought I'm going to keep that and what I'm pointing here is like the, the current set of stickers what I want to use for my dailies what I'm doing daily and stuff so yeah this is just until I can maybe find something better but I really really like I should, maybe should have done it the other way so you can see I mean I just love that that's so pretty really nice uh, yeah and that is the other side of the thing and that's about it my pen I use this was also from Hobbycraft this got different colors on it so you know depending what you're writing you can choose what color you want and that just fits really nicely in this pen loop here I, I can see oh it's just some more I don't that one's escaped I haven't sorted out the, the back pocket yet um, but yeah I really do like this setup I am loving just decorating the pages and doing something different uh, just ab something absolutely different I am loving it at the moment so yeah that is my setup of my ugly dory traveler's notebook all the information will be in the description box of where you can get one of these from oh it's still got that amazing smell on it it really is nice um so yeah i have got a discount code so check that out if you want one of these there is a 10 percent discount code so check the description box out for the links and stuff and yeah next time i swap my things up i will do a, another sort of peek into my traveler's notebook but for now, thank you so much for watching, guys, and I'll see you on my next video. Bye!